Self-mastership. Become your own true love. By Ulla Deswaran. A relationship is never the answer to your loneliness. The feelings of emptiness, unhappiness, depression and self-hate are already inside of you. Most people tend to create new relationships based not on what they want, but in response to what they perceive to lack. They look outside of themselves, saying, When I find someone, I will be happy, satisfied, and fulfilled. When they do find someone to have a relationship with, it is exciting and fulfilling for a few months, or maybe a few years. When the original feelings come up again, they start blaming the other person for their loneliness, depression, self-hate and their unhappy life, and may even start to hate the other person. The other person, in turn, may dim their own light, by demanding your energy, time, and your personality. It is their fear, their pain and their depression that starts chasing you, sucking your energy and imprisoning your beautiful free soul. You may do the same to them because of your own emptiness. This is not what you were looking for. Nothing outside of yourself, not a relationship or another person, will ever bring you true happiness, fulfillment or peace of heart. You are your own hero, your own lover, your own answer to all of your prayers, and your own true love. Nothing outside of yourself will ever truly satisfy you. Today is the day to become your own true love. Start to love every aspect of yourself, including all of your darkness and your light. Start to appreciate and love your own personality. Become your own best friend. Find out what nourishes your soul, and find the sacredness in each moment. Take a walk in the forest. Talk to the spirits. Watch funny movies in your bed. Create art, or write from deep inside of your soul. Start to embrace all that you are in your divinity. Stop waiting for something or someone outside of you. You are what you've been looking and waiting for the whole time. Stop searching, stop demanding. Each of us is a free, sovereign spirit, meant only to share and celebrate our true essences together. Nurture yourself and listen to your inner voice. Get to know you. Give yourself all that you need and want as you start to become aware of yourself. Self-mastership. Find your way home to you, set others free, and thrive in your mastery. You can never be lonely when you actually listen, breathe, talk and fill your own spirit. You must be willing to do some deep soul searching. This means feeling the emotions that are stuck in your energetic field, acknowledging them, and releasing them by crying, breathing, moving the body, or any other way you feel compelled to listen to your own knowing. Make changes in your life to start living your true path, the one that makes you and others come alive. Stop blaming the past, and live in the now. Find your passion and purpose, and start enjoying every moment you are creating. This is finding your way home to you. An outside relationship will only be satisfying when two people have found themselves and if the two people are willing to see that they are individual souls that came to earth for their own journey, their own insights, and their own lessons. Do not be afraid that the other person will go away and leave you. Another person can only stay because of free will. A slave cannot be in loving relationship with a free person. Two free people in loving relationship can give each other wings. If you love a person, and they cannot be free because of your fears, stop the fear now. Stop the thoughts. Stop projecting your fears, past pains and lost hopes on them. Show the other person that you love them by transforming the pain and suffering into bliss and love by doing your work and finding your way home to you. Become the energetic master that you are. Stop loneliness in relationships. Let both you and your significant other be free, my friend. Let them shine. Let them fly. You are both the transformation the world needs to see. You are both the one that can change the world by following your own earthly journey. You can only love another by giving them soul freedom and by stopping all behaviors of energetic demanding, fearing and draining. They may be an angel on your path if they have led you to all of this awareness so that now, you can now find your way home to you. 
if they are the one with misbehavior. You may be the angel on their path that gives them awareness and peace someday. Most people were brought together for a reason in this lifetime, although many times it is not the reason you originally thought, to finally make you happy and fulfilled. The divine universe has led you to uncover the light and love that you are through these broken connections, and the resulting awareness. Become your own true love. Start to be the master you are by truly connecting with yourself this very day. Pray. Meditate. Cry. Say sorry to your significant other for enslaving them, and say sorry to yourself for creating all that you have lived up until this point. No one can alleviate your deep loneliness. You are simply longing for you. Start to love yourself at this very moment. Resonate with people who vibrate on a higher level to complement your life. If your significant other is not willing to do their work, acknowledge, or stop their energetic demands on you, the kindest thing you can do for both of you, is walk away. Surround yourself with aware people who listen to and honor their souls and inner knowing. Surround yourself with people who have a high vibration, who resonate with their heart, who do not energetically pull and demand from you, who let you fly. These people give off light and love because of their enthusiasm for their own journey and their passion for themselves. These are the relationships that will strengthen and nurture you as you step into your own self-mastery. These are the connections you have always dreamed to have with other humans, or possible now that you have found you. Live the life of your dreams. Now. Today. You are the biggest love of your life.